Hey there friends, how's it going? I'm not a huge wrestling fan, but I love wrestling games. They are so good, even if you've never heard of wrestling, they are just wacky. And I found a way to make them even better. I created Royal Rumbles with 30 user-created characters, which are all insane, and I pit them to fight against each other. So that was last time, and I want to make one even worse this time. Okay, so let's head on over to Most Upvoted. I'm on page two, but we can't have him, because if he wins, we have a serious problem. And if he loses, he's never gonna shut up about it. The Rock. Imagine a Hollywood superstar in the WWE. Ha! And with Stone Cold E.T., we're done. We have our lineup. Like, look at these people. Triple H. Logan Paul. Who even are they? Some of these pictures, like, I don't even know what's gonna happen when Squirtle enters the ring. Let's roll. <laughs> number one! It's Bane. My money's on him, even though he's number one. At 54 pounds. Wait, <laughs> it's Giga Chad. <laughs> it's Bane versus Giga Chad. Is it too late to swap my bet? Even the look he gives. It's way too perfect for Giga Chad. I think he's just gonna uh, simply remove him from the ring. <laughs> I mean, he is a Giga Chad after all. If he goes out, <laughs> there goes my bet. But what's he gonna do now? <laughs> He has 10 seconds to just flex on the crowd. Bane is down there just confused. Like, why did they send Batman after me when this guy simply picked me up and removed me from the ring? But well, we don't have enough time to contemplate that because we got Squidward coming in at number three. Oh my god, it's terrifying. It's awful and I hate it. I kind of love it though. <laughs> Anything I hate, deep down, I secretly kind of love it. I'm just worried. Even though I love it, Giga Chad might simply pick him up and also remove him from the ring. <laughs> Why do I get the feeling this is just gonna be a video where 28 people emerge and he just removes them all one by one? Because <laughs> he's killing Squidward over here <laughs> and he doesn't deserve it. <laughs> Joe Biden's coming in. We don't have Trump, but we have Biden. Funny enough, I tried to bear him too. He thinks he's on his way to the White House, but he took a wrong turn, so here he is. <laughs> he walks up on Giga Chad giving Squidward a big old hug, and boy is he pissed. <laughs> he just ran into both of their fists, tried to get in the middle of the fight, and he did get in the middle of the fight. <laughs> Squidward's face! Squidward when Spongebob finally ends and he succumbs to abuse. Oh my god, Giga Chad is gonna destroy them all. Batman's on the way. He's just gonna be confused when he gets there and Bane is already gone. This Giga Chad has just removed them. I must say Batman's putting on quite the show, but he's yet to fight anyone. Okay, he's fighting Squidward, <laughs> as is tradition. But he is jumping around a lot. Poor old Joe is seeing that firsthand. <laughs> Oh, Squidward! Giga Chad is trying to take him out. Batman is trying to assist, but getting a little bit confused. And Joe is the perfect partner for him. Even though Joe is actually looking pretty good now. I don't know how good he'll be against Tomato Man. I don't know what Tomato Man is even from. I'm gonna guess Fortnite? <laughs> All I know is Tomato Man's beating up Giga Chad, and I thought I'd never. Oh, never mind. I was just about to say I thought I'd never see that, but Giga Chad is back on his feet, and um, he's destroying everyone, including Batman. Oh, wait, no! Batman has Giga Chad! Oh my god, he's gonna remove Giga Chad! No way! Oh my god, it's Shaggy Rogers on his way! I'm just hooked here to see if Giga Chad's going over or not. He's hanging in there! Oh, but now it's gonna get confusing, because when I say Giga Chad, you won't know if I'm talking about that Giga Chad or Shaggy Rogers. Or maybe Joe Biden. <laughs> okay, I thought Shaggy was just about to eliminate himself, but no, we're still going. Joe is about to get his first elimination. Never mind, Tomato Man's gonna absolutely destroy him. Uh, we got Lionel Messi coming in, just because I thought it would be funny if there was this absolutely insane roster and then Lionel Messi walks in in his football gear <laughs> ready for football and he gets greeted with this oh he kept the spikes on though he just he just kicked Squidward in the face with spikes sorry I'm a little bit um distracted we'll say this is 
This is quite the show. <laughs> Joe Biden's getting destroyed in the background by Squidward. <laughs> I don't know who's going to be the first gun here. Like, statistically, you would think Squidward, but I think they enjoy punishing him a bit. Like, look at his health bar. It's completely red and it's nearly all gone. We've got the terrifying Stewie Griffin, who looks as if someone just kind of compressed his head down and he grew up but never really changed. <laughs> but hey, at least there's a baby because now Squidward has someone to beat up. <laughs> <laughs> and boy, is he going for it. Lionel Messi has Batman and Joe Biden is kicking Squidward's shins with a very athletic move there, I must say. Stewie just got here and he's like lying on the side, ready to be put out. <laughs> you kind of interrupted your moment of glory there. So as you can already tell, uh, well, if you can't already tell, you might just be confused. So let me clarify it. If you go outside of the ring, I just love how Joe Biden and Giga Chat are supporting each other over there. That is so cute. Uh, but if you go outside of the ring, your feet land down on the ground, you're out. They stop loving each other. And now that I looked back, something changed. You take your eye off the game for one second and it's all changed. But last time, Peter Griffin won. So I don't want to see any nepotism victories here. I want Stewie out. <laughs> Whoever gets Stewie out of there wins my heart. <laughs> oh, maybe Shaggy's gone here. He has absolutely no energy. Chad versus Chad. But then again, Shaggy only needs 1% of his power. Oh yeah, cut away to Biden doing the spins with Squidward. Great, and Shaggy's gone. We missed it. <laughs> we missed it. <laughs> it was just getting dramatic. <laughs> and then we got to cut to Biden going, wee. Oh, Stewie's trying to get rid of Lionel Messi, but he made a messy of it. He didn't get him out. Man, Joe Biden or Squidward getting knocked out would be absolute mercy at this point. They're struggling so much. <laughs> Oh, there goes Squidward. Okay, maybe I manifested that, but I think it was for the best. I just can't wait to get in on this myself. Oh, Squirtle's coming. We're actually going to find out. I placed myself in at number 20. The rest are random, but I'm coming in at 20. There's Squirtle. Oh, things are about to get sweaty and moist as if it wasn't already. And I'm, I'm talking about me, just so we're clear, not, not the game. But the game is about to get sweaty and moist. Uh-oh. Oh my god, seeing Stewie's head just ricochet off the canvas was a lot more terrifying than I thought it would be. He's just, I think it's the image of his face. He looks so depressed and then they're just wailing on him nonstop. Oh, Biden might be gone here. Giga Chad might be about to take another victim. Ronald McDonald is on his way to the ring, ladies and gentlemen, just as Joe Biden is on his way out. <laughs> Honestly, after seeing Biden come to Ireland the other week, he actually looks like he'd fit in the WWE. The entrance he got was the most bizarre thing I've ever seen. Stewie got rid of Batman! They're dropping like flies now. It's just there was a core like six to eight people. I can't remember. It's just a mess of color right now. I think it was eight, was it? Yeah, because the ring was full. It was eight people and none of them would go out. But now they're all like half dead from the attempt. <laughs> Ronald McDonald is the most terrifying. And never mind, Pennywise is on the way. But I was about to say Ronald McDonald is the most terrifying clown I have ever seen in my life. I think we're about to have a clown off. <laughs> but realistically, everyone in the ring, even me right now, we're all clowns. It's like, look what we're doing here. <laughs> this is a mess. Stewie Griffin looks like he's OD'd in the corner. Who did we lose? Ronald McDonald. God, you were not in here long, buddy. Pennywise is making you look ridiculous. <laughs> You're looking penny dumb. Yeah, look at you. Go away. We got Glorilla, which I have no idea what this is, if this is a meme or whatever. I just saw Gorilla that was glowing and I couldn't resist. I mean, the, what can I say? Uh, what is Glorilla doing? though. I, I think he's hurting himself in his confusion. Don't worry, everyone. It's just a healthy radioactive glow. <laughs> I assure you, you're perfectly fine. Wait, this isn't the 1950s? <laughs> it's the Hulk finally on the way for a, a matchup against Giga Chad. Who just got knocked out there? Stewie, was that you? It was Stewie. I know that little malformed head anywhere. <laughs> It's like a packet of crisps when you're taking on an airplane. <laughs> okay, never mind. I was hoping Hulk would be a match for Giga Chad since Giga Chad's been here since like the very beginning. But Hulk can't even take Lionel Messi, so <laughs> he's just kind of relaxing now. <laughs> God, he's nothing like Shrek. The last time Shrek just annihilated half the competition. There was layers and layers to his game. He's ejected from the ring. Oh, 
Okay, I think Pennywise just vaulted the side. <laughs> Wasn't feeling any fear in the ring from any of these people and was, was just feeling his own fear. So just yeeted himself from the ring, it looks like. And there goes... How am I not able to keep track of this? I just saw a heavy thud and a bit of... It's Giga Chad. How could I not realize? It's just he seemed like he was almost part of the furniture, like he wasn't going anywhere. <laughs> Lionel Messi looks like he's going somewhere straight to the grave. Oh, we finally got a Hulk versus Iron Man showdown. Except Hulk is just some dude in green paint and Iron Man is just covered in colorful tinfoil. <laughs> Listen to this what was that, Lionel? Honestly, what was that supposed to accomplish? We got Baldi. I never played this game, but uh, I figured everyone would appreciate this one because I saw it all over YouTube, but never investigated. It looks scary then, and it looks scary now. <laughs> but Squirtle is taking care of him. He's stunned. <laughs> he came in a little bit confident there. He was pretty happy with himself. Well, to be fair, he still looks pretty happy with himself, but that's just because his smile is painted on. Oh, we got Talking Ben on the way. I don't know who this was either it, it's just the picture looked demented so i went with it here's talking ben <laughs> i want to see that face okay yeah that's that's pretty demented i i hate that but as we discussed earlier that means i love that <laughs> i think if i had to pick a favorite right now it would be glorilla <laughs> i really like glorilla um strong character you know, re really draws the eye as well. Very easy to keep track of. And look at him, he's a monster. Oh, never mind. <laughs> he just kind of tripped and fell over. No, Glorilla! Why does everything I love die? Oh, he's hanging on. He's hanging on. Yes! With that gorilla grip, he managed to hold on. And now he's got it out for the Hulk. Oh, wait, never mind. I oh, is that? That is Steve Harvey from Family Feud. <laughs> Come on, any minute now. He'll turn to the camera because someone says something outrageous and just go... And that'll be us. Then he'll be knocked out. He'll have done his part. <laughs> Imagine the terrifying noises Squirtle would be making right now. He managed to save himself, though. The squeals man... Oh. Okay, never mind. I think the Hulk is pissed off. <laughs> Iron Man, meanwhile, is destroying Baldi. No, wait. Baldi's destroying Iron Man. Take that, MCU. You got a new Thanos, and his name is Baldi. Your effects budget just lowered significantly. <laughs> like, he's beating up the Hulk now, and he just did, like, a pirouette to kick Steve Harvey in the back of the head. However, Messi might have to join the Avengers. Messi's been a bit of a, a wild card, doing all right. But now that I've said it out loud, he's probably going to get knocked out within the next 30 seconds. Steve Harvey versus Iron Man. I'm answering those questions that no one ever really asked, but we're all a little bit curious. Oh my god, the dog is gone! Oh, and Baldy maybe? No, Baldy hangs in there. It's those shoes, man. <laughs> he's got the grip with those shoes. Oh, and now he's back for revenge! Glorilla is gone! Oh, what a tragedy. And so early in his wrestling career, I thought he really had a bright future ahead of him. Baldy had a risque answer on Family Feud, and that started a feud with Steve Harvey. He is pissed. Oh, never mind. He's knocked out and possibly dead. No, wait. He's getting up. He just took a fashionable shoe to the face and... Oh my god, Steve Harvey! What are you like? How is he hanging in there? Now he's simply ejecting Baldy. He's decided, I'm done with you, and I don't want you anymore. <laughs> Get out of my game show. <laughs> oh, it's Mickey Mouse. Great. <laughs> if you touch a hair on his head and harm him, the entire Disney Corporation is coming down on you. Actually, no, that is that is blatant copyright infringement. I think the Disney Corporation's gonna be after me. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Steve Harvey. This is just casually beating up Michael Myers, and now he's moved on to the mouse. I'd be more scared of the mouse, to be honest. <laughs> the, the amount of lawyers they would have. <laughs> I just wouldn't be bothered, man. I'd just take a dive. I'd go out. But I don't know if Stone Cold E.T. would say the same. A lot of people on the ground here. Messi, Steve Harvey, Iron Man, and the mouse all lying down. I don't know if uh, Stone Cold E.T. will take kindly to that. Good lord, he's going mad. <laughs> Where am I? Like, we're still waiting to see who I am. I know who I am. I'm the most powerful character in this entire fictional universe. The Kevin Cinematic Universe here. Uh, other than Jim Beckins. I'm the second most powerful 
person in the Kevin Cinematic Universe, but I'm yet to show my face. I think Michael Myers has gone to another dimension. His face looks lower res than the entire rest of the game. Actually, I, I don't know if that's fair, given everyone else is so cartoony. <laughs> that Iron Man is definitely some dude who plays as Iron Man on Hollywood Boulevard, like, one day a week. <laughs> He's not a very convincing Iron Man. The pure chaos of this is just unrivaled. <laughs> the mismatch of characters and lore and... Lionel Messi <laughs> just can't be beaten. I do really like that I've injected Lionel Messi into this as well as Steve Harvey. You know, I guess Steve Harvey's kind of a meme, but they're just like two pretty ordinary dudes, I guess. <laughs> oh, Mickey Mouse went out. I didn't even notice. Ah, oh, well. <laughs> the mouse is out of the house. Two Marvel superheroes dealing with E.T., proving that E.T. is more powerful than the Hulk and Iron Man combined. Although, I don't know if this... This game is much to base your lore on, but I'm going with it. <laughs> Lionel Messi has been defeated by Mike Myers. Don't worry. It's happened to me all the time. The amount of times Mike Myers has hooked me up. I, I'm talking about DVD, by the way, just in case you don't know, because this all sounds very strange. But never mind, my arch nemesis has been removed from the ring. Who has been in here the longest now? I would guess Hulk. But Steve Harvey is absolutely battered. Then again, Hulk just seems to keep getting up no matter what, and he is actually jacked. Almost as jacked as our next participant, Kermit. <laughs> it ain't easy being green, but he's gonna try his best. <laughs> Whoever's wearing that Kermit costume is actually pretty jacked, but uh, he's stunned. <laughs> he walked in and now he's dead. <laughs> I don't think he's even breathing, actually. Yeah, I think he's dead. <laughs> Well, so much for the Muppets. They lasted long enough, I guess. Everything has to go sooner or later. Whoever's next is going to be the next for the Muppets. Oh, the Joker. Joker is joining the cast of the Muppets, everyone. Ladies and gentlemen, Piggy's new BF. That's actually a pretty good Joker. <laughs> Why so serious, Steve Harvey? <laughs> oh my God, he's got the moves. Oh, but so does Steve Harvey. And Steve Harvey doesn't like your jokes. Steve Harvey angry. <laughs> Oh wait, Steve Harvey getting punched in the back and the two sides at the same time. Okay, all right, now it's just evolved into chaos again. Oh, but it's Sonic the Hedgehog. He's on his way. Where am I? I thought I was supposed to come in at 20, but I'm just not here. Oh my God, Sonic is light on his feet. He is fast. Honestly, I don't know how Steve Harvey is in this. Every now and again, he's just lying there on the edge of the ring and no one even bothers hitting him out. He just lies there doing nothing. All right, the Joker finally lost his patience and got rid of him. And it was so effortless. He just decided I'm going to get rid of him now. Here I am, it's me, Gordon Ramsay. Last night I was featured on Raw, <laughs> but today I'm on SmackDown. <laughs> I just want Gordon Ramsay to host every Raw event. Even though I don't watch them, I just tune in to hear him scream that it's raw <laughs> and and then I, I would turn off my television most likely it's now a good time to mention that I don't know how to play um I'm just gonna go over here I'm, I don't want to get in Kermit's way he seems busy <laughs> oh no I'm surrounded by a sea of green and I think they all want to kill me oh I just punched Kermit in the face wait Hold on, this might actually work. I'm gonna break Kermit's arm and I'm gonna make a frog dish. Uh oh, never mind. Never mind. I was joking. I was joking. It would never sell anyway. <laughs> I'm just crawling to the corner in shame. Oh, it's my worst nightmare. Not raw food either. It's Freddy Krueger. I'm just standing up here. I'm hoping if I stay out of his line of eyesight that he might just forget about me. Just everyone. <laughs> He's taken on the whole MCU, but Hulk just slapped him in the face and said no. Oh, I lost my balance and just fell over. All right, let's see how long I can do it for this time. Someone's gonna keep count, right? Oh no, oh no, get off of me. Stay away. <laughs> this is my rope. It's Walter White. I hope it's Jesse in the frog costume. <laughs> All right, Walter, you and me, chef versus chef, let's go. Who's the better cook? <laughs> Punch him in the back. He's a teacher suffering from a, 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 a terminal illness in this universe, by the way. He never broke bad. <laughs> He's doing this for his money now. <laughs> I think Darth Maul just entered the ring. <laughs> oh, please don't maul me. No, stay away, stay away. I don't want to fight. I want to stand up in the robes again. The whole crowd loved that. All right, now I'm going up, everyone. Oh, wait, hold on. Maybe I can help Freddy. Hold on, Freddy. I'm on the way. Oh, no, wait, hold on. I'm not helping. Bre ah, stop breaking bad, dude. There you go. <laughs> Poor teacher. <laughs> Oh, Donald Duck is on the way. I'm gonna serve him up too. <laughs> I'm gonna make my greatest dish yet. Jesus Christ. 
No, don't worry. He's not entering. I, I, I'm just looking at Donald Duck and he looks absolutely terrifying. I'm just staring at Freddy Krueger. Should I do something? Can I hit him? Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. That's not why I'm here, you idiot. Eric Cartman, the final boss. It's down to us last six. Gordon Ramsay is taking a break from doing nothing, but got hurt in the process. Oh, I reversed him. All right, I can get rid of Freddy here. Easy. Oh my God, it might actually work. Punch him, punch him, yes! Punch him, Gordon, punch him! I didn't hear no bell, yes! All right, now get rid of Darth Maul. Give him a little kick in the head, yeah, there you go. There's no rules in my kitchen. Hey, wait, no, stop, time out. There's rules in my kitchen. Honestly, even though I'm still in this, I'm kind of rooting for Hulk. <laughs> Eric Cartman looks bloody hilarious. I'm gonna be over here if you need me, gentlemen. Oh yeah, look at Hulk. He's just been trying so hard, you know? How can you... How can you not root for that? Oh, no, wait. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save him. Hold on. That was my entry move. Stop it, you... You bugger. Oh, no. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not very good at wrestling. There we go. I saved him. And I suffered for it. For my good deed. A good deed never goes unpunished. I've just been lying there for a while. I think they've forgotten about me, because even when I'm standing, I'm not doing much anyway, so <laughs> they didn't notice the difference. Ow! Okay, I'm gonna try and take Kermit, because I, I think I can take him. Okay, never mind. I regret my decision. <laughs> How do I run? How do I run? No, 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 no! <laughs> I'm gone. <laughs> All right. The four remaining legends. We got Kermit, Hulk, Eric Cartman, and Darth Maul. <laughs> Name a better combo. Honestly, the most ambitious crossover in history, this Royal Rumble. Place your bets in the comments now, and there's no going back. Anything said after this is hearsay, all right? We got the Green Boys stunned, Darth Maul on the ground, and Eric Cartman looking on with glee, <laughs> having the time of his life by the looks of it. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, we might have a tough contest here. I still am hoping on Hulk. I know he's got next to no health. Statistically, Eric Cartman and Darth Maul are the, the favorites here. That's a weird sentence. But I still believe in, in the good old green boys, Hulk and Kermit. More so in Hulk than Kermit. I mean, look at this dude. Yeah, look at it. <laughs> I, I had to wait a second and actually confirm that Hulk was the aggressor on that one. <laughs> With wrestling, it's hard to tell sometimes when they're all spinny, you know? You don't really know what's going on. Here we go! Eric Hartman is gone, everyone! What an absolute shock! Darth Maul does a celebratory dance and does whatever that is. I don't know. <laughs> I work here once a month. <laughs> but if you want to support the WW Kevin, be sure to drop a like because we might have another match in future. You know, these events have been an enormous success so far. <laughs> I mean, look at that virtual crowd. They're going absolutely nuts. Hulk is gloating. He has been in here since when? What number did Hulk come in here? And he is gloating in in the final three. And I just think the constant oh, but a crazy kick coming out of Darth Maul there. He hit him with the midair wombo lightsaber combo as we call it in the business. You believe me, right? All right, we got the two green boys stunned, both in weak positions. Darth Maul has him right where he wants them, and I think he's about to eliminate Kermit. No, never mind. Kermit still has some energy left in that frog body of him. God, I don't know what frog spawn looks like, but that frog spawns some courage. I must give it to him. Hulk just kicked him in the face though, so I'm not sure it matters. And then slammed him down on the ground again. And now he's gloating once more. I think the other people could be cosplayers. Depends, person to person. But I'm pretty sure that's the real Hulk. Like, he's absolutely jacked. And he's been going the entire match now. They finally get Hulk on the ropes. And then they're like, you know what? We'll give him a break. <laughs> he's had a rough match. He deserves a break. <laughs> oh, wait. Hold on. Darth Maul is going for it. Hulk has been in this position before. But does he have the energy to go through it again? Darth Maul's about to find out. Spike him in the... <laughs> I was gonna say spike him in the bot, but... <laughs> It was a bit of a weird sentence, so I just kind of failed. But anyway, Hulk lives on. No surprise there. Well, there is a bit of surprise. It's just... Oh my god, he just stood on his face. And then threw Kermit in the air. This should be a two-on-one, and my money would still be on the Hulk. I just feel like anyone I root for gets destroyed. So, I, I, I don't want to, like, you know, say it's a sure thing or anything, but... He's actually the one with the most energy now. Even Darth Maul has less. 
Yeah, see, this is what I was saying. He's dead. He's gone. We'll never hear from him again. Anyway, that's that over with. It's Kermit versus Darth Maul, everyone. Okay, Kermit is just, is just torturing him now. It's like, I love Star Wars. You're bad. Bad Jedi. <laughs> Darth Maul's like, I'm just a guy in a costume, please. Whoa! It's Kermit! Honestly, I'm pretty happy with that. If you told me going into this, the winner be Kermit, I'd say no complaints. He's d he's earned it. He's earned it. I wrote him off at one point, said he was dead. He was out of the Muppets. Joker would take his place. But I will eat my words, and I'll happily eat them with a smile. Kermit, the winner of the second Kevin WW Kevin... Kevin Call Me the Wrestler event. <laughs> The viewers match rating is greatest of all time. If you thought that too, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Check out more of my content here. I really hope you enjoyed that and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now, wrestling fans.